Go a triangle here, tells me some stuff about it. Find the length of BC, that's BC here. So we'll find that. It's going to be sine rule and cosine rule. And I haven't got a known pair, so I haven't got an angle and I know the bit opposite. I know this le length, I don't know that angle. So it's going to be cosine rule. Cosine rule, so that's going to be BC squared equals that one squared plus the other one squared. Doesn't matter which one's which. And then minus two and times those lengths together. And then it's cosine rule, so it's cosine of the angle opposite the length we want. That's 40. And that gives me BC squared equals 135.5904. And if you, if occasionally, if you, get, if you get to square root it, then you see on 135, no way. 9, 8, 17, it's just not going to happen. But make sure you keep the BC coming down. Square root of BC squared is the length we want. 11.64432, which equals 11.6 centimetres to three significant figures. Don't forget to round. Part two, area of triangle ABC, and the area of triangle equals half of the two sides times together, times by sine of the angle between them. So in this case here, it's a half, nine times 17, times by the sine of the angle between them, that's 40. And that equals 49.17325, which equals to three significant figures, 49.2 centimetres squared, it's an area, and that's that part done. Point D, it's on the line AC, so D is somewhere along this line AC, such so the angle B to D to A, is 63 degrees so that's going to be something like this and that angle there is 63 degrees and now here I can use the sign rule I always like to use the sign rule if I can uh, because I've got a known pair I know that's nine and I know the angles opposite so what I tend to do is I tend to start with a thing I want to find out we've got to find the length BD so that bit the length BD is what I've got to find so if I put in there BD, and so the length, the unknown is what I'm going to start with. So BD over sine 40 equals, and it's going to be over sine, so it's going to be a length on top, 9 over sine 63. And so BD equals 9 over sine 63 times by sine 40. Some calculators, when you put a value, open up brackets, don't forget to close it. That gives me that BD equals 6.492756, which equals 6.49 centimetres to three significant figures. And does it look like it could be something like that? Yeah, always just check it. Uh, probably be best for you to draw a diagram when you're doing that part, in the very least. Question one done.